we do have quite a few with the zipper. Uh, this particular one does not, it has the flap, but we do have our linen pillowcase that has the zipper. And if I'm not mistaken, I think we have another one that has the zipper as well. Um, so yeah, do y'all sell that design too? Uh, this is the only one that we sell is the, the retro, I think it's like retro flowers or something. Uh, will that work with heat press box on shirts? I've only had a couple of shirts with no heat press box. I don't understand that question. I apologize. I, I, she's referring to, is there, I guess, a method to eliminating the creases? And oh. there is. And, and the vapor foam is primarily for, um, for shirts. That would be the number one use of it. And I certainly recommend it along with deckling the edge. All right, guys. Let's give some stuff away. Okay. So I have a weekly review winner. Guys, remember, go to our website, condi.com. Go to the product that you just bought. Go to the review tab. Leave us a review. You can be entered to win $25 in Condi credit. This week's winner is Jennifer Starr. Jennifer just bought her SG400. She said uh, the printer and all the extras arrived well packed and promptly. She received her printer after 7 on a Friday, called tech support on Saturday to set me up. Andy from Condi called back and had me up and going in 20 minutes. It was smooth and painless. So glad I chose to buy my printer here. Can't beat this kind of tech support. Jennifer, thank you. Thank you. Shout out to Andy. Love our tech support yeah, Andy, guys. Andy, um, our crew is, um, they rotate who does after hours and weekend support. And I think Andy probably does a little bit too much. We need to, um, you know, give him some free time, but he does a super job. I could use some free time. All right. I'm just kidding. I love my job. No, I do. Okay. So last week we were going to announce the monthly gallery contest winners but we weren't able to so let's do that for this month so we have three winners and this is for 200 150 dollars our um, theme was your best use of aluminum and in third place with a 50 dollar um, condi credit is few frugal fashionista by tony awesome yeah so she did this really cute stack metal so that's a stack metal this is stack with metal. the with the that background the background is the other part so it's yeah. a little a little hard to detect the stack metal but it, it, from this angle it looks really good oh hey jennifer congratulations love all right so in second place we have squirrel squared they did these really cute door hangers wow so very nice, nice. yes love it so you could hang it from the wall, hang it on a doorknob, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then our first place grand prize winning $200 is Marilyn Leonard um, from, uh, that's it, Marilyn Leonard. Uh, she has won $200 in Condi credit. This is a wow. steel message board. So you can write down, you know, like your tasks Monday through um, Sunday. <laughs> Sunday. Nice. Uh, so yeah, so Very congratulations attractive. guys. Good deal. Congrats, I was going to show everybody um, one of Sprite's creations that I found um, in the corner here. And so Sprite, you want to tell them a little bit about this? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. So this is, uh, I think, as a matter of fact, I think we did this on oh, Facebook it's so, Live. Oh, so beautiful. So this is a, um, a stacked piece of metal and it's two different finishes. Um, the back is a clear, yeah, the back is a clear gloss and then the top is uh, just a matte. White and, matte. Yeah. And so you can kind of see the contrast. Just in absolutely it. gorgeous. It really is. Um, it's the, really, you really know, pretty. seeing it obviously in person, it's even more dramatic. But but what a great job! Yay. All right, cool. All right, okay. So one more thing to give away, and then we're going to go to our other contest. So um, we do our twenty-five dollars weekly, 
And this week is So Creative, which I love that name because it's S-E-W, Creative, So Creative. And she is doing these t-shirt quilts where people are sending her photos in and she is sublimating them onto t-shirts and then quilting them. So I thought this was a super cool idea uh, on how to integrate sublimation with different media. So yeah. Cool, so yeah. Cool. So uh, Patricia, you have won $25 in Condi credit. Awesome. And this is the kind of uh, sharing that, that just, you know, just affects me emotionally because these are great ideas that all of us can use to grow our businesses. Yeah. Hey, yes, ma'am. Oh, oh. Oh. Okay, so the um, so the stacked metal is um, so there is a Chromalux connection that we sell, and it's uh, two pieces of metal of of it's a it's a piece of wood, and then it has another piece of wood that you hang. And so I just took the piece of wood. Um, it has a double sided adhesive on one side. I used E6000 on the other side and uh, let it sit for about 72 hours. Let it cure. And then that's what gives it that stacked effect. So we have a bunch of these blocks, if you will. They're, they're made of um, MDF blocks. And um, you can buy them in bulk, so to speak. And you can use some for the back, some for the um, uh, separation. Yeah. So inexpensive product. And you think about how much a product like that's worth after you do it. Um, and you really didn't... You know, this, this background is just a, you, you magnified the, yeah. the foreground, mm -hmm. um, and then you've, you know, you, you planned it so that it would align well. Uh, just, just fantastic. And I, I really like the $150 product. Oh, without probably. a doubt. And I, I really like the contrast because it really makes this pop out. And you can, you can actually, you can really see it well on, on camera actually too. But like when the light hits it, it looks really good too. But when the light's not hitting it, I mean, it almost, it's almost holographic. It's pretty cool. So it, it just, I, you know, every time I see it, I go, that just looks amazingly good. Um, you know, and and that's what people are looking for. People are looking for value, especially with their their keepsake photographs. Um, and so it's your job to show them what they can buy. I mean, if you never tell people they could buy something like this, then then they can't. So. Um, you know, you need to be doing this, and that's you. You post that on a client gallery, then you get the link, and that's why we did it so that it's very easy. Um, really, no excuses for you not to be able to share with others um, what you have done. David, Julia would like for someone to bring it a little closer to the camera. That piece. Okay. On YouTube, I guess. Um, Facebook. No, Facebook. Facebook. So. Let's see if I can get the right angle here. That's probably a darn good angle there. Mm -hmm. stuff. And then you can see the block in there. And how the foreground being a matte white does so well. So you can just see how you turn it. You can but the with the foreground being matte white, it really pops. And then on YouTube, you can just um, see how well so just uh, an amazingly you know think about how simple this product really is and how high value it is and and um, one of the ladies that I give credit to the innovation um, I've spoken her name before is Gabby Mullinex there in Fullerton California she really was the visionary many years ago that started coming up with these great ideas for stack metal for um, the the Chrome Lux bracelets, things like that, uh, and so if you're ever there in Fullerton, Fullerton Photo, um, please check out check out that we have a number of interviews we've done with her, plus plus her videos. All right, I'm excited about this last thing because um, honestly, this is the first time I've ever printed anything um, like this, so um, so I'm excited about it. So we have. This is our throw nine. 
rude. All right, this is our throw nine, and I've already done six of the panels. So I don't know if you guys can see that, but I've started a dinosaur. Isn't that, I know, isn't that cute? Let me see, wait, so why am I not? Wow. I'm, I'm, I'm being, that is adorable. isn't that cute? Ah! That is. All right, so I'm gonna do the last three panels with you guys. I'm way too short. Okay, so we're gonna do the last three panels. While I'm doing the last three panels, I need you guys to guess the weight. So you have this, 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 and this. Tell me how much it weighs. The first person that is closest to the weight. So you can go over, you can go under, whoever is closest will win all of these things. How much time on the clock? Until I'm done pressing these. Okay. What is the size approximately of each panel? The approximately nine and a half by 16 and a half. So I did this on my SG800 on 11 by 17 paper without a bypass tray. So that's pretty cool. All right, so. How big are the panels? 16 by nine. So I did it on my SG-800 with my bypass, without my bypass tray. Okay. All right. So, so start guessing, guys. What will that sell for? Um, yeah, so David, I've seen these sell for uh, anywhere between $100 to $150. So, and they run you about $20 to $22. So, you know, you're looking at a a huge ROI here. Yeah, and a lot of folks, they use them for photographs, you know, kids, grandchildren, family kinds of photographs. So it is, it is um, obviously amazing keepsake. Um, it does take obviously more work because you got more photographs, more panels. Um, another version of this is the uh, non-paneled version. It's just one big panel and you can order those through our print services because obviously you need a big printer, a big heat press for those. And um, they're just amazing. Do we have one in our lobby? Um, one of the, um, um, you know, I think, think uh, maybe go peek over there on the couch. Um, it's, a, it's a throw panel, throw, throw um, but it's a single panel. Um, just look on there, draped over the couch or no, something. No, it's a nine panel. It, it oh, never, never mind. Is never that mind. a nine panel? No, I don't know. So at any rate, um, this has been, been a really great product over the years. Um, very durable, feels nice, um, you know, really gets the job done. So, yeah. um, you know, I, I think uh, it's great that uh, this is a great product to do because I think a lot of people probably are not familiar with it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and it's really, e I mean, it's really, really easy to do. So you do just a quick pre-press, you know, a lint roll, and then you press it for a minute and 15 seconds at 385 degrees. Super, super easy to do. Yeah, yeah, Elizabeth said she sold hers for $100, so yeah. Cool, cool. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Keep those guesses coming in, guys. Yep. Yeah, I'm really excited about this. Um, this blanket. So I actually got this idea from somebody in our client gallery. Um, they did this really, really cute um, blanket and they did uh, a bunch of uh, tribal symbols in it. And I thought, you know, let me do a dinosaur blanket. Why not? Who doesn't like dinosaurs? David just left me. I don't know, whatever. You don't have a pad under that. No, Tammy, I don't have a pad. And we are kind of on the prices, right? A little bit, yes. Ah! It's just so cute. I don't know if you guys... Okay, so this is the one that I just did. Right? All right, so we're going to move on to the next one. So all I'm doing, I have a piece of protective paper underneath it. I'm just going to pre-press just to kind of flatten it out for about 10 seconds. We found a blank one. We found a blank one. And um, should I show the blank one? I know, Khaki. I know. 
Patricia, I'm, pl I'm, I'm pressing this for about a minute and 15 seconds. Not about exactly a minute and 15 seconds. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but I actually took my transfers and I cut it all the way down to the end of the design. And that way I can um, you know, make sure that I'm lining them up on the panel. So a little bit of Pro Spray. By the way, we recommend spraying Pro Spray normally over a garbage can or if you do a lot of spraying, um, take a box, build you a little spray booth um, and that way confines the spray. Hey, spray. hey ma'am. Karen wants to know where you found those cute little dinosaur designs. iStock. I found the designs on iStock. Yep, sure did. I love iStock. I do. All right, keep on going, guys. We are um, almost there. Just a little bit left. We got one more design, and then I think, we, I, think we, I think we have a winner, don't we? Do we? Yeah, we got a winner. We got a winner. We do have a winner, yes. Sweet, and we actually know who it is this time. Um, yeah, so Julia, uh, Julia, it does come divided into the panels. So we have different throws. Like David said, we have the one big throw that you're going to need a big press for. And then we have this throw, which is a nine panel that you can do on your, um, your uh, DK20. So. So, and the printer that I use is an SG800. Um, because the panels are 9 by 16, I use an 11 by 17 inch paper. Yes. Okay, almost there, and I got one panel left. So, yeah, something like this. Um, you know, like my best friend, uh, she just told me yesterday that she's pregnant. So I'm really excited about that. And uh, so, you know, this would be really, really cute for uh, like a baby's room or a birthday present. I mean, you know, like say, you know, your kid's into planes or, you know, lizards or, you know, you're trying to teach them the ABCs or just, just anything. And um, we're doing things fast here. Do recommend your lint roll. Um, the thing, you know, and, and just make sure that it's okay before you press it. Yes. Mary wants to know what would we need for a SG400? I'm not sure what she's referring to, though. So, to get into sublimation, computer, printer, heat press is generally what you need. So, with the 400, it's, it's a turnkey system, comes with the cable, comes with a pack of paper, uh, letter size. Uh, a few pieces of metal. It comes with the inks, uh, you know, full full cartridges. So um, from a printer, you're you're, you're good there. Um, you do need a heat press. We recommend George Knight presses, um, and then you need a few accessories um, like uh, potentially the vapor foam kit, green pad, Nomex pad, heat tape, Pro Spray, um, lint roller. Um, cover paper, uh, and then of course things to decorate. At the computer, you have to make your decision about what software you're going to print with. Um, if you don't have any software or don't know any software, then um, Creative Studio is bundled with the printer. It's a cloud-based designer and a um, great way to get started. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Oh, guys, February the 8th, we have a webinar coming up with DAS, how to grow your business with the Premier Graphics Program. That's from 2 to 3 p.m. Eastern Time, Central Time, because we're in Central Time Zone. It's nice. Um, Karen, yes, I do have some stock photo sites that I recommend. My go-to is Pexels, P-E-X-E-L-S. They're free and P-E-X-E-L-S, -E Pexels.com. Okay. Um, they, uh, the majority of them are, um, are for commercial use. Uh, they're pretty high quality. I kind of like the effect that they have on them. Um, other than that, iStock and and that, you know, that's pretty, that's pretty much, that's pretty much it. I mean, if you can't find what you need on iStock or Pexels, then, you know. 
Yeah, so uh, one lady, um, Mary, asked how you would do the, uh, oh, great job. What? Wow. Hey, yeah. sometimes. Can you bring that closer? Nope. Okay, yes. Uh, how you would do it on SG400. Unfortunately, in the SG400, you're, you're limited to a width of eight and a half inches. Can you zoom out? And a with margins slightly less than that. So I don't have an um, instant <laughs> plan on how you would, you would do it with a 400. There you go, YouTube. Hope you guys can Sorry see about it. that. Isn't that cool? Look what I did, guys. It is. Da, 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 da. All right. So. We have a winner, and who is our winner? Right here. Her name is Cindy Shep. She was the first one to guess, and she guessed two pounds. Well, congratulations, Cindy. All right, Cindy Shep. It was exactly two pounds. You were the first one to answer two pounds, and we will send you all of this stuff on Monday. Cindy Excellent. Shep, yeah. Thanks. So thanks, guys. Um, Ma'am? What she said. Oh, um, we, let's, let's talk, we, let's talk about one more thing. Um, so, uh, we have January flash sales going on, and right now we have our porcelain heart ornament, which is on sale just in time for our monthly gallery contest, which is your best use of your, or show us what you're doing for Valentine's. Yeah. Also, um, one, one comment is Universal Woods, which is the folks behind Unisub, the folks behind Chromalux, they have their annual price increase. And we've held it off at this point in time until probably the end of January. So this is the time to stock up on your Unisub products before the prices go up. So um, uh, be sure to take advantage of that. Um, uh, you know, some things are not going up much. Other things are going up a little bit more. We certainly apologize any time a price increase has to be done. We'd prefer a price decrease. But um, take advantage of the Unisub 2018 pricing uh, now. Um and uh, somebody asked about the blankets, and um, no, this is, this is not an itchy blanket. This is a blanket that I would use at my house. It has a piece of tape on it. I see that somewhere. Um, I'm all backwards. Uh, there it is. There we go. Um, but no, I would totally uh, wash this and use this. In fact, you know, feeling it, you, yeah. you would not, not say it's, it's polyester. It, it just of feels a little bit like the linen to me, but. Yeah. Cindy wants to know um, how we will get a hold of her or how she should get a hold of us. Okay, Cindy, um, I, hopefully you're a Condi client. She is. Okay. Okay, well then, um, yeah. She doesn't know her rep. That's okay. We'll look you up and we'll, um, we'll get with your rep. If you don't have a rep, we'll, we'll, we will assign one to you and, uh, and we'll get it all sent out to you. And yeah, yeah and you're winning um, a blank. Um, youth pillowcase, a blank linen pillowcase, a blank gaming cloth pillowcase, and a blank nine panel throw. If you don't know who your Condi rep is, um, usually their initials are going to be on your invoices. Please get to know your Condi rep, um, know their email address so that you can um, communicate with them. They'll have great resources for you. One of them certainly is the um, pricing spreadsheet. Um, that's a good resource. I think there was a question about a calculator. Yes. Um, Do you have is a, there any sublimation calculator available? Um, I think we've got some cost spreadsheets, um, but basically um, from a materials point of view, you have the substrate, paper, ink. And so it's pretty easy to calculate what your costs are. If you're using a desktop printer, good rule of thumb is a penny per square inch for full color. And, um, and that gives you a little bit of a margin for some waste, but then paper. So it's, it's remarkably easy just to do a quick mental calculation um, of it. So for instance, um, the pillowcase there, what is that, about 9 by 12? What is that? The um, pillowcase? Yeah, the, um, 
Oh, um, this, it, I think, right, it was like, A little bit bigger than that, I'm trying to think. I think it's think. like 18 by 11, I Okay, think. so 18 by 11, or so, something like you that. know, you got, that's probably about a 75% coverage, something like that, maybe 80. So, um, um, maybe that's, um, what, um, 18 by 11, 108, we'll just say 200 square inches, that's about $2 in ink, being very conservative, probably less than that plus the cost of the pillowcase. Um, we have another question. How do they know if the image is high res enough in order to um, make these kind of products? You may ask that. Yeah, go ahead. So at print resolution for a soft substrate, we want to have 150 DPI. For a hard substrate, we want to, we want to be at 200 DPI. So um, many programs like Photoshop or Corel when you've sized your photograph at the like the bottom left or something, they're going to show you what your print resolution is at that point. Um, and so, as you make something bigger, the print resolution goes down because you're spreading the dots out. Uh, when you push them together, they they go up. So you just need enough dots um, to reach those numbers. Corel Draw Graphic Suites 2018 software. Do we sell the full blown version? So the question is regarding Corel Draw 2018. We sell the full blown version, one time price, and it's yours. We sell um, the what what we refer to as the OEM edition, meaning it's for our industry. We don't sell outside our industry, Corel, and therefore you get the full version for about half the price of what you would pay if you went to Sawgrass. So I think our full version. We sell for something like 295, where the real version is 400 and something. So um, we're a hidden treasure when it comes to saving money on Corel. If you don't buy your Corel from us, then then something's wrong with your math. I think that's all of the questions. Let me check YouTube real quick. Nope, we're good. Okay. Well, it's been an honor, pleasure to be with all you, and um, we hope to um, meet again soon um, right. at ISS. And again, um, everybody thanks Sprite for her um, great effort. Um, did just tremendous over the top. So thank you. Take care. Have a good weekend. Love you, Mom. Bye, guys. Thanks. <laughs>